So if we're doing the balancing elements part uh, photo, um, really what you're thinking about is doing the rule of thirds with something in the background. So I'm going to be using this plant right here, this flower. I'm going to focus in on there. My focus of my picture and the planner box that's in the background as the thing that's going to balance out the rest of the picture because it's not going to be just an empty space. Let me see if I can frame this properly. Get that in focus. I'll take a couple shots here. Maybe from a couple different angles. Let's see. I don't want it to be too close because I really want it to take up that empty space. So if I do it this way, let's put the little plant right on that crosshairs there. Maybe you want to get a little closer to it. Let's see if I can get to focus there. There we go. different angles. Maybe I could, no, I don't think I want to take it down here. It's not enough of the plant. Maybe we could take it so that it's, there it's right next to each other like that. Right. So we have a couple different shots here. Let's look at what I've got. So I have this one, which is pretty nice. This one. Hmm, I'm not liking that one as much. I mean, it's okay. It's Definitely not that one. I don't, I don't like that one. That one's alright. So, I think I like some of these last ones here. Either one of those are pretty good. Alright, so I'm going to go ahead and put that into Nearpod now. So before I do uh, put that into Nearpod, I want to just do a quick markup on this so you guys can see what I'm talking about when I say something's in the background. So here's my subject matter right here, okay? And it's right in the crosshairs of my, my grid line if I were going to draw that in. Here's, oops. Oh, you can't see that very well. This one. So here's my grid lines right here. Um, let me go ahead and erase those because they're in the way right now. So that's my subject matter. And then my Things in the background, um, it's really taking up this, the empty space that would be right here. Um, because you have that, usually if you're doing a rule of thirds, you have some sort of space that's on this side. And the thing that's taking up that space is going to be right there. Um, I'm, you know, filling that empty space, it's kind of like filling the void. It's usually not in focus. Um, it's usually not part of the subject matter of the... Um, of the photograph, but it's just, you know, making sure it doesn't feel like there's a big empty void there. So that's what we're talking about when it comes to that. I'm gonna go ahead and delete those two things, those things so that I can upload that to our Nearpod. All right, so here we are on our balancing elements page on our Nearpod, and we're gonna go ahead and, oops, not that one, I'm gonna add that picture in there. And I like that last one that I picked. I think this was the best one. So I'm gonna go ahead and put that in there. Make it a little bit bigger. Nope, too big. There we go. And the directions say, if I look at the directions, they say draw on the grid lines and circle your subject. So I'm gonna go ahead and do that now. Draw on the grid lines. Oops, whoa, way too big. Let's see if I can undo that. Do make that nice and small there. So here's my grid lines. I guess I'm doing it white. And I'm circling my subject. I'll circle it in a different color. Right there. And once I have that done, I can go ahead and submit 